These women in rural Tamil Nadu, southern India are producing something that could one day help change the lives of thousands of others. Low-cost sanitary pads. Menstruation in India is considered taboo, with only 12% of Indian women using pads. Cost and a lack of education mean many use cloth or other unhygienic materials instead. But with pads now more available, that could one day become a thing of the past. We feel much more free now using pads than the cloth. It's very good as we can go out and to work. When we used cloth, we were always afraid of leakages. For all the success of low-cost pads here, the credit goes to a man, Murganandam, an ex-welder who created a machine that can make up to 40 of them for less than a dollar. Unless you're empowering the women of the respective country, development will not happen. So where does development begin? From menstrual hygiene. Sumati is part of the success story. She invested in Muruganandam's machine and now has her own brand of pads and employs up to 10 women in her small factory. We talk to people and try to convince them. We talk about the ease of using pads and how it's healthier because they're pure cotton and manufactured without any chemicals. Back in the workshop, another woman has shown an interest in buying Muruganandam's equipment. With each machine, he says, 3,000 women can benefit from using hygienic pads. He is now looking to take his know-how to more than 50 countries by 2020 and believes this will create jobs for some 10 million people worldwide. A true revolution in women's hygiene.